Hello Aries, so this is the weekly reading I have for you guys. So I will be using the Holy Water deck. I will be posting the link of where you can purchase these. Um, these are made by a California artist. She's a very beautiful soul. Um, definitely check out her website and follow her on Instagram as well, okay? So universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Aries? Protein today will die for February 1st to the 8th, 2021. Universe, give me three my cards. What messages do you have for Aries? Protein today love life for February 1st to the 8th, 2021. Universe, give me two my cards. What messages do you have for Aries? Protein today love life for February the 1st to the 8th, 2021. Universe, give me one more card. What messages do you have for Aries pertaining to the love life of February 1st? Okay, good. Um, I see at the bottom of the deck, I got Gemini. So some of you guys are connecting with a Gemini. Or there's going to be a lot of communication with the person that you want to communicate with, okay? So I got rebirth in reverse, okay? So some of you guys are connecting with somebody from your past. This is Mercury retrograde, okay? This person is basically probably coming back. I got mirror I got mirror effect. Yeah, so some of you guys are connecting with a past person who could have been a mirror to you. This person could have been a karmic person for you. Okay, but there's a lot of love there. I feel like both of you guys can't let go of each other. You guys have a deep roots with each other, with Earth being there. Okay, and then at the bottom of the deck, Gemini. So I feel like, again, you guys are going to be communicating a lot this week. Um, it's like an end... <laughs> unbreakable bond okay unbreakable bond that's what i'm seeing it's very strong it's deep rooted this is someone that you have so much love for and you're like still in love with this person okay or this person's still in love with you so let's see what the right of rate um deck have for us so universe the person that's on aries mind and aries what is the current energy for them for february 1st to the 8th 2021 Universe, the person that's on Aries, mine, and Aries. So the two of swords. So I feel like a lot of you guys are in a crossroad, okay, about what to do next. The current energy is a two of swords. So both of you guys might be on a crossroad of like how to proceed with this connection, how to move on or move forward with. So yeah, it's showing that both of you guys are on in a crossroad. So let's see. Universe, the person that's on Aries, mine. Um, what they would like to say to Aries for February 1st to the 8th, 2021. Universe, the person that's on Aries line, what they would like to say to Aries. The death card. Okay. So this can be someone from your past. What they would like to say to you is that they probably end something with their own past. Okay. Or end something currently and they want to head to your direction. Okay. I'm going to see what else I'm getting. Universe, the person that's on Aries mind, what are they keeping hidden from Aries for February the 1st to the 8th, 2021? Okay, what they keep in hidden from you is that they really want to be in a relationship with you, okay? So probably they're coming back to talk to you, okay? But in reality, they want to be in a relationship, okay? They really want to be in a relationship with you. Um, let's see. So they might just say, oh, they just want to catch up to see what you've been doing. But in reality, they really want to be with you. Universe, the person that's on Aries' mind, how do they feel about Aries? Okay, how do they feel about you? They may feel that you are walking away from them or that you have walked away from them. And I feel like they're still trying to process that. They're still going through their emotions as well. Universe, okay, this one will come out too. Universe, the person that's on Aries' mind, what is their true feelings for Aries for February 1st? Okay, their true feelings for you is that they're waiting for you. And they may express that to you when you guys communicate. They say they have been waiting for this time for you guys to talk, um, to see where it can go, okay? To see how it can be balanced. Universe, the person that's on Aries' mind, what intentions do they have with Aries? Oh, I don't like their intention, though. Okay, I feel like this person's petty. I'm going to keep it real. You might be done with a Scorpio. or a fixed sign. A Taurus, Leo, um, Aquarius. This is somebody who's petty as hell. Probably this person is was waiting for you to see when you can take them back. 
and then you probably t- like you know or trying to talk to them you know and i feel like once you actually give them that opportunity and they feel comfortable with you that's when they are going to do the same to you so you deal with the petty person i'm going to keep it real universe the person that's on aries mind what actions will they take with aries for february 1st to the 8th this came out horizontally so the seven of cups the seven of cups is about illusion and confusion okay so this is somebody who is trying to be petty i feel like they are trying to one up i'm gonna clarify that universe cup for the seven of cups universe cup for the seven of cups four of pentacles yeah they're gonna give you mixed signals after you after you after the first breakthrough of this of reconnection okay universe clarify the four of pentacles Universe cover four pentacles. Yeah, one minute they're going to hold back, the next minute they want to communicate. It's like this weird type of energy. But when they're doing that, they're still holding on to you. Okay. Universe cover the page of pentacles. Universe cover the page of pentacles. Yeah, one minute they're in isolation, next minute they want to be in union. Universe cover the hermit and the ten of cups. The will of fortune. Okay. So th- yeah, I feel like this person, they're immature. Okay, um, I feel like they still want to be with you. They don't want this to be over, but is it at the same time? It's like they're trying to teach you a lesson. It's weird. Universe cut for the will of fortune. Universe cut for the will of fortune. Universe cut for the will of fortune. Yeah, they're petty. Universe cut for the five of pentacles. Universe cut for the five of pentacles. Yeah, oh my, their intention is horrible, to be honest. They're petty as hell. Oh my gosh, some of you guys are dealing with a Taurus. You're dealing with a fixed sign. I'm getting a major fixed sign. Taurus, Scorpio, Leo, Aquarius. Um, This is a petty person. Universe, cut right there, swords. Yeah, they're petty. They trying to, yeah, they trying to manipulate. They trying to see, like, how they can get you back get back at you like like you know whatever you did to them that hurt them so probably it was like no communication so once you guys have that first initial breakthrough they're gonna do the same thing where there's no communication you know what they just trying to mirror what you did to them that made them feel some type of way okay they're petty okay <laughs> that's what i'm getting but when they doing this is like they're not it's not an attempt of to completely drop you and leave you alone i'm not getting that they're doing this because it's like to teach you a lesson because you hurt their feelings. So they're sensitive, okay? This person's highly sensitive person. So major fixed sign energy, okay? Scorpio particularly and Taurus. Um, could be another Aries too. Um, Gemini, a Leo. Um, I got Virgo here too in Aquarius. So I would be putting their energy more. Okay, so universe, give me a three card spread. The person that's on Aries' mind, what is their current feelings for Aries for February 1st to the 8th, 2021? Universe, give me one more card. The person that's on yeah. So, yeah, they may feel like it was one-sided. Oh, Lord. Yeah, they may feel like it was one-sided. They feel like that, um, wow. Yeah, this is definitely a past person. Um... They feel like it was one-sided. And they try to release you, they can't release you. And it's like now, beca- because of them not can't releasing you and they see that probably it's an opportunity for you to take them back or to just talk to them, they're going to be petty. So I feel like even when you do talk to them, their intention is like, how can I get back at Aries, okay? That's what I'm getting. It's like really petty energy, childish energy like i got separation release your ex i require love religious factors yeah i feel like this is someone who don't listen to their intuition as well with religious factors it's toxic i'm gonna keep it real like it's 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 looking toxic universe can i release your ex i feel like this is also advice for you as well release this person this person's still operating with toxicity or just pettiness okay
Okay. So, universe, give me a three card spread. The person that's on Aries mind, what is their true feelings for Aries for February the 1st to the 8th, 2021? Universe, give me two more cards. The person that's on Aries mind, what is their true feelings for Aries for? So, um, patience and planning. Yeah, I feel like this person is planning on you. It's like they was waiting for the moment for you guys to talk or reconnect so they can be petty and do what you did to them. Like, even though it was not even major, probably just like silent treatment. They're going to do the same thing, okay? I got emotional withdrawal, recognition reward, and spiritual strength, okay? So it's like this person feel like they they should do that, okay, with recognition reward and emotional withdrawal. But it's like the intuition trying to say don't do that. But they're still going to proceed to do that, okay? They're not listening to the intuition like I was mentioning before. Okay, let's see. All right, so universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Aries pertain to their love life? Actually, universe, the person that's on Aries mind and Aries, what messages do you have for them? Universe, the person that's on Aries finds an Aries. What message do you have for them for February the 1st to the 8th, 2021? Universe, give me two more cards. The person that's on Aries, mine and Aries. What messages do you have for them for February the 1st? Heartbroken. Yeah, this is someone who's going to be petty. Like, they're going to try to come in a direction like with love, but in re in reality, it's like they're trying to make you feel a certain type of way, okay? I got, for the bottom of the deck, general energy, seduction, okay? This person, yeah, it's like they're trying to see how they can entice you, how they can win you back just to hurt you again, okay? So, attraction, flirting, dating, hooking, I mean, hooking up, temptation, third-party interference. Then I got not today. So, it's like the universe wants you to not, like, focus on their energy as much, okay? Not dealing hurt avoiding conversation call person boundary so angry they might do that too they might do a silent treatment if you did that before to them okay then i also got keys on the ring and love like i feel like this person's still in love with you it's just that they're petty okay and that's their shadow like their pettiness overcome their intuition and the intuition trying to say don't do that so i got keys on the ring many option decision unconventional string along one night stand Love, unconditional love, self-love, oneness, passion, aff affection, and attraction. Yeah, they're very much attracted to you, just stay petty. Heartbroken, being um, deeply hurt, sad, separation, breakup, feeling lost, grieving, and mourning. Yeah, I feel like because of the breakup, it really hurt them and affected them. So it's like they're trying to be petty. So when they're trying to come back to you or when you guys have the conversation, it's like they're trying to have a front like, oh, yeah, everything is good. Like, you know, yeah, we can work on it. And then... When you when you guys are comfortable with each other again, that's when they're gonna be really petty and flip it like flip it on you basically. Okay. So that's the reading that I got for you, Aries. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a personal reading with me at Queen for the Tarot at gmail.com.